Live from Lala Rink in North End over Massachusetts, it's Hockey East action as Merrimack takes on Colgate. As the play is in the Colgate zone, the correct pronunciation, by the way, is Grebel. And a quick shot here from the point by Felton is blocked. Here comes Colgate. They've got an on man rush. Raiders have a man cutting to the net. Shot score. Ben Raymond on the two on one whistles it by Hugo Olas. And at 527, Colgate is on the board. It's 1 0 Raiders. Warriors just barely able to keep it in, but they turn it over. And a chance here. Moving in for a breakaway attempt. What a save by Olas on Ben Raymond. Seifert had a goal last night. Colgate on their second power play. In a chance down low, and Olas comes over and makes an incredible pad save on Colton Young. Quick shot, Olas makes the glove save loose, and it's sent wide of the goal. Merrimack will use the glass to get it out the center, where Anderson will go cross ice with it. Raiders into the offensive zone. They'll tap it back up top to Anderson. Anderson, now far circle. They send it down low, low score! Alex Young buries it into the top corner of the net. And a power play goal at 9.46 extends the Raider lead to two to nothing. A lot of times not enough. Chance here for the Raiders as they bring it in the zone. Broken up. Merrimack looking for an odd man rush. Calvary. Wits. Welsher gets it to Welsher. Shot. Oh, what a glove save by Guylander. Merrimack with their best scoring opportunity of the game. And Guylander was there to make the save. They've only got 32 seconds with which to work. Hillier ahead for Brar. He puts on the brakes. Felton a drive. And Guylander got a piece of that. Now the Raiders at center will backhand one in deep. Wide of the Merrimack goal. Ziblack angles it around for Jeffries. Jeffries plays it out to the point. Quick shot block. Chance here. Score from the slot. They started on the firewall, and the Raiders got it in front. And it was Alex DiPaolo. Colgate comes out of the corner with it. In front. Warriors able to come down ice. Here comes Jeffries. Jeffries into the zone. The penalty is up. Jeffries right out in front. Lepinen! Oh, what a save by Guy Lander. Lepinen just firing it wide. They just weren't able to do that, but they put enough pressure, and Merrimack had the puck rolls off the stick. Lepinen tries to tuck it inside the post, and it goes just wide. And things like that happen sometimes. Well, he approached the halfway mark of this third period. Colgate. Doing all the little things tonight. Score from the point. Outside the far circle. Anderson with the goal. And now the lead appears to be insurmountable. It's 4 0. Lebel, the clean win for Bookman. Cross ice feed. One timer kicked out by Guyland. Yeah, I said six on three. It'll be six on four when they come back. Up on top, here's Bookman. Bookman, far circle. Over to Jeffries. Holding it. Front score! Off a of deflection, Leibold will get it, and it's four to one. A power play goal for Merrimack. Warriors finally break through on the power play. And Greg Carvel's team coming out firing on all cylinders. UMass and Merrimack Friday night at Mullen Center, and then Saturday right back here at Lawler. Brar sets it up down low, and Forsmark finishes it off with a goal. 14.42 to the time, so don't go away. It's now 5-2, Colgate. Warriors need three goals in 93 seconds. Quick shot block. Here's Demon up on top. Gets it to Forsmark. In front, jammed out. Loose, and a score! Ryan Liebold will pick up his second of the game, and it's now a two-goal affair. Time's going to run out on Merrimack here. Colgate led throughout. And the Raiders will earn a split here in North Andover. Colgate scored the first four goals of the game. They survived a late Merrimack challenge. And the Raiders win the second game here 5-3, to three, Mike.